Kavanaugh's. So who brought this home? Do you think you could answer some questions now, Mrs. Black? Of course. However I can help. We found a receipt in the trunk of your husband's car for a live pig. This receipt was made out to an F. Morgan. A pig? Adrian runs a tool business. That would be Frank Morgan. God knows what he's up to. You're lying. You killed your husband, and Morgan helped you cover it up. How dare you? I love my husband. On what basis could you possibly accuse me of wanting to hurt him? It's hardly surprising the police force has such a bad reputation, with people like you representing them. Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. But you knew where he was really going because you told him to meet you at the rail yards. That's where you jumped him. How did you hide the body? You have an overly active imagination, young man. Do you have any proof of that allegation? My husband is missing. You say he may be hurt, and the best you can do is berate me? You're a poor example of a man. Your husband frequents Kavanaugh's bar? How did you know that? Adrian practically lives there after work. You're lying, Margaret. You're a lush. Kavanaugh's is your hangout. Your tiny mind must really be aching. Do you have any evidence that proves I've ever been in that bar? I'm going to have to ask you to leave. I'm going to ring my attorney. I hope you're well paid, detective. Was your husband wearing his glasses when he left here yesterday? Yes, he just bought a new pair. That's a lie, Margaret. You know exactly what Perry was wearing because you were there. You're being flat out ridiculous now. Why don't you show me some proof of where I was supposed to be? If I was there, at least I'd know what happened to him. But I don't, detective. And you might not care. But that is the most terrible feeling. Oh, is that all? I would hope you're taking this case more seriously, detective. That would be Frank Morgan. God knows what he's up to. The situation doesn't look good, Margaret. You need to tell me what you know. There's no need to be so aggressive. I'm also a victim. Adrian practically lives there after work. Your husband would rather spend time in a bar than be at home with you, Mrs. Black. And that makes you angry. Yes. It does make me angry. But I know my place, officer. Unlike you. Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. So you didn't arrange to meet him out at the rail yards? I've never been near a rail yard in my life. Was your husband wearing his glasses when he left here yesterday? Yes, he just bought a new pair. So you disposed of the new pair after you killed your husband. You made a mistake in leaving the old pair behind. I never did. How can you be so heartless, throwing around accusations at a time like this?
just a minute.